Northwest District Division II swimming in Bowling Green. The top two finishers automatically qualify for the state meet and the next 16 at-large times across the state. Here are your automatic qualifiers from the Northwest Division. Girls 200 medley relay. Salina taking the top spot overall with a time of 148.44. In the girls 200 freestyle, Wasion's Brooke Schutte making a statement, a solid first place finish at 152.88. Boys 200 freestyle, a second place finish in automatic state bid for Napoleon's Kyle Hudson with a time of 142.06. In the girls 50 free, a fight all the way to the end. Napoleon's Kaylee Nagel gets first place 23.54. Ada's Klava Katayama with a second place spot 23.59. Boys 53, two more top qualifiers from the WOSN and TV26 viewing areas. First place, Brandon Arandondo of Wauseon, 21.95. Second place, Danilio Martinelli of Wapak, 22.16. 100 fly for the girls, an exciting moment for Ada's Clava Katayama. Not only did she finish first in commanding style, she set a new meet record with a time of 55.79 the second automatic qualifier for the 100 fly was from Ottawa Glendorf, Sydney Porenshock, 57.8. Other automatic qualifiers from the Northwest District in the girls 100 free, Napoleon's Kaylee Nagel, first place, and Meggie Voigt of Bryan in second place. In the boys 100 free, Alex Honigford of Wapak, first place, and Brandon Arandondo of Wauseon, second place. Brooke Schutte of Wauseon and Brittany Boisel of Napoleon, first and second in the 500 free. Bryant's Kellen Rigg takes second place in the 500 free. Wapak's Boys 200 free relay took first, and Shawnee Boys 200 free relay took second. In the 100 back, Salinas Kenzie Kahn first place, and Ottawa Glendorf's Maddie White second. Napoleon's Kyle Hudson finishes first place in the Boys 100 back. Claire Gass of Salina, the first place finisher in the 100 breast, and Ottawa Glendorf's Sydney Porenshaw coming in second. The official list of D2 state qualifiers will be released by Sunday. Reporting from Bowling Green State University, this is Jennifer Beck for the Sports Report.